So this is this is an FPS game, part developed or part influenced by Shroud, the big FPS streamer guy. Uh, I got into the closed beta for it. Um, apparently, I'm sponsored. Only in game, not in real life. Uh, speed reading, yeah, speed reading. That's a, uh, that's how that is actually how fast I read. I'm in, I'm incredible at reading. I don't know what all this is. This looks crazy. Let's take a look. Can we watch the? I'm guessing we can't watch the trailer again. Nah, probably on the main menu again, but not here. The audio is low though. Master volumes at one. The game's quiet. Interesting. Eh, uh, okay. Sponsor. So what's this then? Four of eight sponsors unlocked. Are these different abilities? Okay, these look like different abilities. So we've got Pinnacle International, which has a grenade with splinters, uh, a stamina heal, a flash grenade. Got smoke bombs, caustic fluid, which is damage over time, and a trap that cloaks itself after deployment. Deploy a barrier that blocks bullets, heal a damaged ally and their spectre for 80. Swarm grenade. And the last one I've got here is sonar spike. A proximity mine that sticks to the ground. And then... Deploy a sentry. Okay, cool. Welcome to cruise. With cruise you have a chance to earn fame by taking your crew to the division leaderboard. Okay, so this is like guilds. Yep. Your locker. The hell? Who wants to look like this? I don't, I don't, I don't know actually that fast about what I look like. Weapons, damn, a lot of weapons. Attacker, anchor, attacker, specialist, fender, anchor. Interesting. Um, is there like a tutorial? Yeah, there is. Okay, let's try out the tutorial. See what we think. See if it's good or not. We'll see what happens in the tutorial. But yeah, so this game actually isn't out yet. This is in development. It's a closed beta test. You can apply on Steam. You can just go onto the Steam page and say, I want to play this, and you might get accepted. I was fortunate enough to get accepted. Uh, so Welcome to we'll Santa. see. Let's start with. We'll see how it is. I'll give you my, my raw, unfiltered to opinion. Waypoint. Move towards the highlighted way. Sensitivity feels okay. Feel knife. Let's go is to the basics stuttery. of duality. Every player will control a second body called a specter that you can freely swap between at any moment. We say one mind, two bodies. Okay. You can use duality as a second life to cover multiple bomb sites across the map, or even to play two angles in the same area. Now, swap to your Spectre and move to the marked location. Ooh, I swapped to my location. Is that Shroud Twitch? You're a natural. Yes. When you throw the puck, it'll move your Spectre to that location. The puck throw will let you deploy your Spectre to some places you might not normally be able to reach. Use puck throw and swap to continue to the waypoint. So you you control where you go. Ah, okay. Interesting. So, and then what? X. Great, you got that. Move towards the highlighted waypoint. Huh. Great. Keep going. Jump to clear that obstacle. Okay, so shift is actually to walk, Crouch which is to get awesome. under that obstacle. Remember, keeping your spectre alive is key to getting to hard to reach places. Throw your puck up onto that ledge. I've done it already. Swap to your spectre. Once you're comfortable with puck throws and swaps, feel free to move to the next area. Ah, there's a delay. Swap, swap bodies to start the weapon trade. Before each round of combat, you have a limited time to buy weapons and equipment. Okay, so it's just like Valorant. Now. What does it want me to weapons buy? A weapon pair? Oh, okay. A different weapon on each body. You can try as many as you like right now, but remember, in combat, you'll have limited money and time to choose. 
Interesting. While waiting, your specter body is able to detect enemy footsteps and ears. You'll receive an alert from your specter when like the enemy the is running nearby. Shoot the enemies as they appear. Shoot the enemies. You always have better accuracy while aiming down sights. Yep, that makes even sense. Predator Divide features aim down sights as gunplay allows you to shoot full accuracy while moving. Center dot tells you exactly where your next shot will land. Hip fire is only effective at close range when spraying. Okay. You're getting an alert because your spectre hears something. Swap bodies to check on that threat. Swap bodies oh, that's interesting. That Oh, I don't, I don't know, I, I don't know, it's weird. The fact that you can just, uh, it's a very cool gimmick. I don't know how it would play out in the long term. Equipment use is key to success in Sentai combat. At the beginning of every match, you'll select from a list of sponsors, which will determine your three Okay, so there's the sponsors I was looking at. Equipment sets are different for each sponsor. You'll want to learn them all. Winter. There are two ways to throw a grenade. Overhand throw for longest range and underhand throw for nearby targets. You might need to bounce your grenades to hit enemies behind cover. So where's the enemy? Splinter! Splinter! Why don't I just... What's the button? Why is why is a grenade on... You? You're getting an alert because your spectre hears something. Swap bodies to check on that threat. Splintering him. Grenade's been on Q is weird, but it also oh, feels like um great. It's because it's an ability. Match, it's not always gonna be grenades. Is to eliminate all enemies or successfully plant and detonate the Zeus. Let's start by picking up the Zeus. What's the Zeus? You have the Zeus. Let's the bomb. try planting the Zeus in the designated zone on site A. Okay. Interesting. Zeus has been planted. The Zeus will take a while before it detonates, and enemies will try to defuse it. How long it does it take? Off. Great. Let's move to the next section. Now let's see what it looks like as a defender. So I've, I've had to go in here. I feel like it takes a while. You must defuse the Zeus before it goes off. I'm actually quite a big fan of the art style. Uh, it's kind of borderlandsy, but like a more simple borderlands. You need to eliminate all attackers before they plant the Zeus. I really quite like it. They do plant the Zeus. You must defuse it before it detonates. Like what's it called? Like there's a name for it. I can't remember what the name for it is. Use knife to take out the enemy through the door ahead. You move faster when holding your knife, so switch to it when you're in a hurry. Ah, stab. That enemy dropped the Zeus. Press Z to ping the Zeus. Right, so I can also press middle mouse. Great. Now head to the exit. Try What's the... Past this reveal wall. What's when the you um this, your location revealed. is revealed to attackers? Oh. You'll stop being revealed to enemies once you exit the reveal area. Now let's see what it looks oh, wait, like. Wait, so this is revealed. How did you know if that's a reveal area or not? Pick up a gun. Pick up a weapon. Bullets can penetrate some types of cover. I revealed some vulnerable enemy targets. Shoot them. You've been practicing. Interesting. Good old badass. Great job completing your training. Spend I'm gonna beat the training. The practice range to get familiar with the sponsors, weapons, and your new duality skills. Then okay. Get out there and forge your legacy in Santai. So where's the? Where is the? Area to train in? Oh, that right. I mean, yeah, it looks quite cool. That was just a tutorial. It gives you a good idea of what's to come. I'm going to assume there's somewhere I can practice. Here we go. And we can have a proper look at the guns and such. It's a cool idea. I think there's only three people a team. 
in this, believe it or not. I think there's it's like you three on three, but then obviously you've got two characters. So it will be six on six. Um Well, really? Yeah, kinda of six on six. It'll be interesting. It'll be interesting to see how the gameplay works Welcome like itself. You know? Meltdown. So that. Damn. I instinctively pressed F1 to see what the skill's done. That's the button in Valorant. And it's the exact same button. Throw a grenade that creates an area of caustic fluid. It's a very small area. Throwing meltdown. Very small area. This was the... Smoke. Oh, it's a smoke. Okay. What's this? Placing the grasp. The grasp. Deploy a trap that cloaks itself. Explosion enemy gets too close. How do I get guns then? Was he shotgun? Okay, pistol. I wonder what the time to kill is gonna be like. So there's there's different tiers. Tier one, tier two, tier three, tier four, tier five, and I'm gonna assume. This is a machine gun, is two machine guns? Why is that two machine guns? That's so odd. It looks so weird, the fact that that's two machine guns. Oh no wait, your spectre gets one. Your your other character gets gets one. Ah, okay, I get it, I get it. So the assault rifle and the... Okay, interesting. F2 to change spawn, so let's try something else. Let's see, we've got grenades here. Splintering this was the splinter grenade we've seen. Adrenaline. Adrenaline? Okay, that's a heal. C. Flash grenade. Flashbang? Oh my days! That's a yep. That is a flashbang. Yep. Okay. Good job. We've got Q as a shield, so you can't shoot through it, but it doesn't take a lot of damage to break it. What's this? What's this? Heal a damaged ally. Okay. Cool. And then C is another smoke there. Yeah. Can you go into the smoke grenade? You can, and you're uh, obviously reduced visibility. Can you shoot through it? Yeah, you can shoot through it. Okay. I wonder if uh, you'll be able to see uh, through the smoke, or bullets come through the smoke, you know? Wave scan is Q. What's this? Wave scan. Oh, does it pulse towards people? Throws a sonar spike that pulses things towards your active body. Enemies hit by a pulse will be revealed. Ah, okay, so it, it's trying to scan, but it reveals your location. That's a mine. That's a sentry. Okay. Keep pressing escape. Dual amp. These are the ones we didn't look at, actually. Dual amp. Dual amp active. What the? Wait, so if I leave this, I, I want to try something here. I left this with one bullet in it. And I can shoot with this one. I swap back. Okay, it still has one bullet. What happens if I do it when it's reloading? Ah, if, it, if you do it while it's reloading, it will... It will reload for you. That's cool. Uh, what else was this? Vector wall, slow Seven moving wall. wall. Okay, that's for pushing sites. Nanosphere, go. Nanosphere is... Damage. Okay. Present. Partition, patches, recon wing. Partition. Deploy a wall. Placing partition. Ooh, okay. That's interesting. So you place oh, it in a line like... Like this, you can block off, 
you walk through? Yeah, you walk through. Dupe. This is to Running a dupe. Dip them. See dead zone. dead zone? Throw a grenade that creates a large distortion field and blurs the vision of players inside it. Ooh, that's cool. I like the effect that gives you. That's a cool effect. This next one is patches. Deploy a drone that moves forward and heals you and your allies. Deploy a flying drone that follows your crosshair after one second the drone explodes. And Hyperdome, permanent fast recall zone with 150 health shield. What's a recall? How does that work? Healbot out. Okay, healbot. This Rolling will then dead. follow your drone. Follow your. So you can do this Rolling and throw it around corners. Hyperdome. This is Hyperdome. Okay. Interesting. Recon wing, throw a drone that sticks to the first target that hits. Pulse, pulse finder, instantly equip scan at the pulse every second, every two seconds. Deploy a drone that charges. So this is. Rowan recon wing. Recon wing? Okay. Pulse Running finder. Pulse. This just runs in the background. Enemies hit or detected and leave markers. Okay. Then see. What the hell? Blinds all players in the AoE. Interesting. Okay. Uh, was there anything else? What was this here? Okay, let's go and see if we can get a game.